The story of Done It For Checks is the tale of hopes dashed, a gut hunch, and a dream fulfilled. This lovely gray daughter of Hall of Fame member Hollywood Done It out of silver and blue checks was bred by McQuay Stables in Fold in 1996. She was injured as a two-year-old and never got the chance to compete. But Hall of Fame member Tim McQuay believes she had promise as a broodmare, and was he right? Done It for Checks is, simply put, one of the most successful broodmares in reigning history. She was started at Oldenburg Farm, but Cardinal Hill Training Center in Aubrey, Texas is the mayor's current home where she gets the star treatment she deserves. Chexie was purchased by Cardinal in 2013 in a deal that included the weanling by her side, none other than Done It For Whiskey, earner of $215,000 under Franco Bertolani and the 2016 NRHA Futurity Reserve Championship. The mare seems to cross well on virtually any stallion. She has 21 performing foals sired on eight different stallions with 19 money earners. At 22, Done It For Checks is close to becoming a million dollar dam, has eight foals left to be shown and is still being bred by embryo transfer. Large, beautiful eyes, that long neck and strong legs are among the traits owner Joao Marcos says he sees stamped consistently on her offspring, like Done It For Whiskey, now a breeding sire at Cardinal Hill. There's also Starbucks sidekick, earner of nearly $200,000, Hollywood Knights, earner of $72,000, Wranglin Checks, earner of $70,000, and Mast Gun, earner of nearly $68,000. Done It For Checks is one of the grandest ladies of reigning and proof that performance delayed is not performance denied. Though she never got her shot in the show pen, she's helping Cardinal Hill create a breeding legacy that will have an impact there for decades to come. Congratulations to 2018 NRHA Hall of Fame inductee, Done It For Checks.